Day by Day, presented by First Community Credit Union. In agriculture, every season is different. It takes hard work, determination, and passion to keep a farm or ranch going year after year. At First Community Credit Union, we know and understand that passion for agriculture. Our local staff can help farmers and ranchers invest in new equipment, expand their operations, and prepare for whatever challenges may lie ahead. Together, we can achieve success now and for generations to come. First Community Credit Union, rooted in your future. All right, fellas, let's go now, let's go. Get, get those touches up. I'm at like 250 right now. Lots of touches already for me. Lots of touches today, boys. Raider, Raider Payton, let's go now. Emmett, let's go now. Let's go, Gavin. Let's go now. Grant, let's go, Grant. Let's go, Simon. Let's go now. Yeah, I think change can be really healthy. And that's the way we approach it. When there's change, we're gonna, you know, promote it and make it positive. And the guys are really rallying around Coach Schwen's fire and the defensive staff. You know, we know who's leading the meetings and, you know, yeah, we want to simplify and we want to play fast, but there's a lot more to it. Just how we want to be around each other and a lot of positive energy can go a long way. Hey, Beach, get him going. Jack, get him going. Hey, get him going. Yeah. Hey, Caden, Malachi, Caden, Malachi. Yeah, what's up? Spot the spirit there where I can stand on your guys' sideline. Sure, absolutely. Bring some juice though, so we can stand on our sideline. That's the only requirement, hang with the defensive guys. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm pretty ready for it. It's been a, a, a you know, a, a building process for myself, kind of. You always think about these things, and then when you get your opportunity, you want to do it a certain way, or you know, how to operate something a, a certain way. So you kind of always think about it, but now it's like your, your opportunity, you want to go seize the opportunity now. Snap around, two yards away. There you go, good, and then run your face good there, D-Hunt. Been kind of a progress here towards that point now. You know, through the summer here, we worked on a lot of stuff as a staff and went over a lot of things that we wanted to get implemented this fall, and so it's kind of fun now to kind of put your fingerprint on the, uh, the program and, and kind of put our stamp on how we're going to do things, and it's been a fun process so far. It's a tough one, but you shouldn't see it, okay? I don't want you to be thinking 2 and one That's hard. Yeah. That would be really, I'd be asking a lot. Yeah. Now, if you can do it, it might change our defense a little bit, but. <laughs> when you get a guy who's been around the program for so long, played it uh, at UND, been a coach here for a while, um, you know, Coach Schweigert always says, you know, for new guys and for coaches and players, you always got to earn your respect. And uh, I think, you know, Coach Wentzfire stepped in and did that right away. And yeah, everyone respects him. Um, he's a great leader, really good at talking to people, really good at, at getting the team going. The players really love them, and I'm really excited for them this year. Guys, guys, don't drift. When you snap around, you don't want to drift. Hold your ground, hold your ground, and then we're going here. You know, if you get guys that were in the program or have been in the program a long time, they take a lot of pride in this program, and it means so much to them. And they don't really have to learn and be here to learn what it is and that this is a special opportunity. They already know it. It's in their DNA and you can just see it in them. This opportunity, you know, he stayed here for years. He started as a graduate coach and went through as a part-time and position and, and just grew a lot from those experiences. And now this opportunity, he's taking full advantage of it. Once you kind of get the, uh, get in this program and it kind of gets in your blood a little bit, it's tough for it to get out. And it was something that as I went along in my career, then that's, those thoughts kind of started coming to my head. I'm like, this was a lot of fun. And, and the impact that the coaches that I had when I played were so big on me, I want to have that same effect on our guys. It was a yep. corner. Yep, you take the outside one. Inside that, you were good. Oh! 
Get there, Sammy. There you go, good. Coach Schwentz Fire, you know, he's been taken over and kind of been like, hey, we need to change some things and we need to be more mentally sharp, stuff like that. So we've really been working this off season and it's not like we got a lot of new guys. So when you get a lot of older guys who don't want that same result, it helps out a ton because you kind of, you see, hey, what went wrong and what can we do to fix it? And it's just been a great summer of preparation. I mean, we got some six year guys here that are awesome to lean on. They're great leaders, guys that are invested in this program and understand how big of a deal this is and, and how much this program means to them. And, and for those guys to kind of take a leadership role on it and, and even giving us feedback on how they see things on the uh, the day to day operation or how we practice or what we're doing, those guys have a voice. And we want to let those guys have a voice because they've been here a long time and, and they, it matters to them as well. Good juice and Team Temple. Let's keep this thing up though here, all right? Yes, Ted, Ted, you got us, all right, man? Hard job. Hey, man, be the most physical dude on this football field today. Hockey out three, one, two, three, hockey. hockey. Here we go. Circuit group, circuit group, circuit group, circuit group. So when you have you know, great older leaders at every position, uh, it's, it really helps out, and I think Coach Fenster really appreciates that as well because you know, the coaches don't work as much with us over the summer, and when you have older guys that can really take control and run drills and run indie and, and get guys working on their own, it's really effective and really helpful for the team and the coaches and the young guys. So I just think it's great to have a player-led team and to have old guys on this team. It really helps a lot. Yeah, having a bunch of the six years is great. I think with a lot of experience, uh, we can help out the younger guys, you know, show them how we do things. And just having experience on that game field is a big advantage. Uh, going out there for the first time, it's always kind of like, what's going on? But having a bunch of games underneath your belt, you can uh, go out there with a lot of confidence and, and, and put that confidence on the other people that are out there. Uh, making sure that they know that we're there for them. And uh, even off the field, if they have any questions. Um, I know when I came in, it was you know so much going on with school and football. So just making sure that you're there for them. and you know. Just being the best leader that you can be, whether you get a lot of playing time or not. Uh, you know, it, it's short here, so you gotta just make sure you have a, the, best, the best time that you can. Yeah, you better be the same guy every day. I, I talk to our guys about that a lot, you know, and that's a challenge. Can you be the same guy every day? Can you be that enthusiastic, positive guy on day one? Because everybody's excited day one and all the optimism that you feel. Can you do that on day seven and day eight when you're getting tired and sore, you know? Can you be that same guy every day and just bring it every day with the focus and the concentration to get better? We just need to continue to come out here competing, using a lot of energy, and just having fun. At the end of the day, we all play this game because we're having fun, so make sure we come out here, make each other better, keep each other safe, and get ready for a good season.